Hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Nondu Nison Changase. So I decided to just do a short video about the SAB Zenzele Gabili shares. I've been having people blow my phone up since yesterday regarding these shares because there's a buzz about it. So I'm just going to share what I know about them and then you can make a decision on whether you actually want to buy these shares or not right but uh, remember that my videos don't constitute as financial advice so don't go buy those shares because i gave you information and then you say i said you should do it no please make sure that you consult with a person who's registered and certified with um, the financial sector conduct authority should you require financial advice i'm just giving you financial information and information that i know regarding these shares right um so let's just get uh, right into to it so in 2010, um, SAB, but maybe just before we even get to that, we all know what SAB, the, the, you know, SAB sells, right? We know, we all know. I know you guys know. <laughs> so actually from that, you can determine whether this company makes money or not, seeing how South Africans are every time Cyril says no more alcohol for everybody. Anyway, let's move on right along. So in 2010, um, SAB Zenzele shares uh, launched uh, where, you know, SAB employees, uh, their retail customers, um, tavern owners, uh, bottle store owners were given an opportunity to actually sh uh, own shares in uh, SAB. Uh, those shares, they say if you actually bought for 100 rands, value of 100 rands, Today, it would be 77,518 rands, which is a lot of money. So those shares, um, though, are different from, you know, the ones that are listing in the sense that you had to hold them for 10 years. Um, but the shares that are now available uh, will be trading on the JSE, like, you know, your normal shares, but they are only available to qualifying people, right? So uh, they made a decision because they saw that the first scheme was actually a success and then they made it uh, now available um, and list, listed it or have, are listing it tomorrow on the JSE, uh, BEE side of, um, or segment of the, of the stock exchange. So what will happen uh, is that this uh that you know the first people who actually had ownership so the beneficiaries of the first scheme uzenzele sap zenzele will actually have first deeps which means that they will um uh, first decide if they want to buy these shares first and then they will be available to the public right they are listing at 40 rands per share um but the beauty of these shares is that because i see people are rushing thinking that oh my gosh if i miss this opportunity i'll not have it again these shares are going to be listed and they will be trading like you, you know your normal shares um so they they list at 40 rands but that doesn't mean that um they will actually remain at 40 rands uh due to a lot of people because we know that with the hype a lot of people will probably be probably be buying these shares they're probably going to increase in you know in terms of share price uh, when they list tomorrow we don't know or uh, people could be selling them uh, and they could end up being cheaper so you must also bear that in mind when you're buying these shares that they not um, that the, the, the price will actually um, be going up and down like you know your normal um, shares so don't think you're missing out uh, quite yet you still have the opportunity they will be listed indefinitely which means that you can sell them and uh, you can buy them at any time so you still have that opportunity um i know that they said easy equities i just read an article saying easy equities does not have these shares available uh but they will be available through the invest tech trading platform and i know computer share uh, also has the, um, the the shares available so tomorrow when they list those platforms will have um the the shares available so when we are talking about the value of these shares how you could have bought uh, at a value of 100 rands and then be receiving 77,000 odd it does not necessarily mean that if you buy them now and just and just sell them that you're going to receive the same value the value is in the time remember they were listed in 2010 and then people are only receiving that value now so that 77,518 rent is pre-tax so it means it's before tax it's still going to be taxed so just um bear in mind that the value in it is in you keeping the shares for longer 
and um, that's where you actually start seeing your money work for you, right? So these um, BE shares, which means, as, as I stated, is it, it is an empowerment scheme. So um, it's 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 people who qualify under the you know the Triple BE Act. Um, so they are not available to everybody. They are actually shares that are meant to empower you. And you know because we know that in the past you were not given such opportunities. Now this opportunity is being given to you. So it's up to you whether you use it or lose it, right? So. Yeah, um, I think uh, I'm going to leave um, the link to CompuShare uh, on the description box and also the number, um, the toll-free number that you can call for information regarding these shares. Shares will be available um, tomorrow. They are listing tomorrow. We're excited to see what's going to happen, but just be um, cautious when you're buying and not just buy from any, um, you know, random company that's not registered make sure that um, it's linked to the Johannesburg stock exchange because we don't want you to uh, be ripped off uh, yeah so let's um, let's see what happens tomorrow uh, and uh, happy investing hope you have a good day